Right, so we're back guys, in the RS3, and I thought I'd make a little video today on something. I know I made a video before on five things I hate about the Audi RS3, but today I'm going to make a video on something like that is really starting to get on my nerves about this car. I was thinking about it last night, and I thought, why did not I make a video on that, or why did I include it in the um, in the other video, because it's, it, it winds me up more than anything in this car. I know you're all having a guess in your head now what it is. But I don't know if it's a common problem or if it's it's not a problem and it's it's supposed to do what it is doing. So if you do know, let me know because it's it's really starting to wind me up now. Uh, so get in the comments box below if you do know what it is or why it's doing it or if it's supposed to do it. I know you guys with um, RS3s or maybe even Quattro cars will be able to tell me cause if it's doing it for you it's probably supposed to do it as well um, but what it is is the traction control always seems to come on when I put, like I put my foot down and even though I'm not planting my foot sometimes it just starts and I'm not going fast at all I don't mean try and go fast sometimes it just like flashes up flat, um, traction control it doesn't let me move fast, it doesn't let me put my foot down, it just the revs start building up but I don't seem to be moving anywhere and all of a sudden it'll bite and go so it's really started to wind up like if I'm taking someone out in it because I want to see how fast the car is I put my foot down sometimes and it's embarrassing because I put my foot down, do not go anywhere and I'm like oh well I've got to turn traction control off to show you <laughs> because you shouldn't have to turn the traction control off to show someone how fast the car is but sometimes I'm having to do this and it's not it's not what it should be it's um, really disappointing so yeah l let me know if you know why it's doing it I mean I'm hoping to god it's it's something that can be fixed because if not it's a bit daft you've got to change from traction control just to make sure 100% of the time you can put your foot down and actually go somewhere because I'm not happy with having to turn it off all the time and obviously it's not very safe when you have to turn it off even though I'm not too fussed about that because I like having a bit of fun in car I like it when it scares me a bit throws me off the road <laughs> but yeah let me know if you guys have the same problem and hopefully I can fix it and um, if not I'm going to ring Audi up if you guys don't know what it is either but apart from that guys like I said, I'd, um, when I told you about the jobs I did to afford my car, I told you about the second income I did, which was um, Herbalife, which obviously meal supplements, sports supplements, energy supplements, skincare, everything. And I've got my um, Herbalife shake this morning. This is basically an healthy meal, so if you want to have it instead of a meal, or maybe you just want to get your nutrients and multivitamins in you guys, you just take that. And obviously you'll be feeling better in no time. I used to be able, well, I used to want to go to sleep all the time before I got on it, and now I just I'm awake all the way through the day, and obviously I can sleep at night. Obviously, but I'm not as tired as much anymore, and I've got lot, got a lot more energy. And yeah, you just feel a lot better when you're on it. So if you want some of the products, I'm sure there'll be a link in the description, or maybe if you want to start selling them yourself and start making a second income yourself, it's really good money, extra four or five hundred pound a month. Uh, well at least if you put sort of put a bit of effort in and um, obviously the person who signed me up he's on £15,000 a month now so if you do well it's there's real good money to be made in it guys so let me know if you want to get involved but yeah the main reason I made this video was to tell you about this problem about the traction control so let me know if there's a way to fix it or let me know if you guys know how to fix it or if you guys have the same problem and let me know what you want to see in future videos because I'm starting to struggle with ideas for future videos now. So yeah, thanks for watching guys and as always, see you next time. Bye!